स्टार्ट वेलकम टू आंध्र प्रदेश सर्व शिक्षा अभियान के सी बी बी ऑनलाइन क्लासेस माई नेम इज पी सुभाषनी वर्किंग एज ए पी एस सी आर पी इन रामपुर के सी बी बी विजयनगर डिस्ट्रिक्ट ओके स्टूडेंट हाउ आर यू आई होप दैट यू आर ऑल सेफ एट यूर होम्स ओके ऑलरेडी यू लर्न द टॉपिक कोर्स सो दिस इज द लास्ट कॉन्सेप्ट इन दिस चैप्टर द वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक इज नथिंग बट प्रेजर सो चिल्ड्रन इन अवर डेली लाइफ वी यूज द टैग प्रेजर इन सो मेनी टैग वॉट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ प्रेजर सो वेन यू गो टू यूर होम आस्किंग यूर चिल्ड्रन सो दे सेट दैट सो Pressure is nothing but uh, so many people told me that uh, today I have work pressure, today I have homework pressure, so I feel very pressure about the exams. So these people are telling the pressure about pressure. So pre- this type of pressure is we feel the stress on our minds. So it is a invisible. pressure invisible stress so today we will learn about the physical quantity and physical real and pressure so here pressure is nothing but a force a force which is acting perpendicularly on unit area is called a force that means pressure is equals to force by area okay children the force acting perpendicularly on unit area is called pressure so this pressure is working as perpendicularly on a object this force acting on a object perpendicularly Uh, unit area. This type of force is called pressure. So this pressure also called as stress. This pressure also called as stress. So the SI units of pressure is force. We can measure the force in newtons and area in Meter square, we know that. So the SI units of pressure is newton by meter square. It is also called as Pascal also. Okay, children. This is the pressure. Now we see the other effects of the force. So we can see the pressure in our daily life, but we can we don't know uh, about the pressure but because now we can recognize the pressure effects so children take your pen ball pen and push your the pointing finger with this pen so it is uh, hurts you the other part of the pen pressure with the your finger it does not uh, hurt you why because think about this and also children you are using the school bags all are taking this bags you are in last year jagannath kanka vidya kanka bags so every school bag has a wide belt why because the bags are wide this because the wide bags to carry our when we carry our books the wide band cannot hurt our shoulder so it is the uh, it is it can it is decrease the pressure on your shoulder so that's the why the school bags have a wide band okay children next now we observe the relation between area and pressure Okay, children. I take one tray with full of sand. 
In our textbooks, they take a lime powder because it is not available, available to me. So I take the sand to do this activity. And also I take the two bricks. Okay, children? So I put I drop one uh, brick into the on sand. Okay? And another brick also I drop in this sand. Now I remove these two bricks at the top. Children, you carefully observe the two bricks in the sand. So the vertically I dropped um, brick is more deep into the sand, and I dropped the horizontal brick is. is getting little bit sink in the sand. So what do you observe in this case? Why it is dip into in the sand uh, more than uh, the horizontal drop bit. Okay children, in this case we observe the relation between area and the pressure. When the brick is entered into the sand, so all the pressure is worked on this little surface. So it is more different to the sand. sand. So this brick has a more surface area. So for acting of force is less than to compare this brick. So that's why this brick is different to the more in the sand. And this brick is less than to this brick. Okay, children. And also, we observe the cutting the vegetables. Our knives have a sharper edge. Why the other knives has a sharp edge? Because when we apply the force on the uh, knives, the sharp edge can cut the vegetables. The total area, um, the total force is acting on the surface area. Here, okay. Once again, we are discussing the formula of pressure. Pressure is equal to force by area. Children, we know the relations in our mathematics. These quantities, the pressure and force, the pressure and force are in the according to this formula, the pressure and force are the proportional ratio. That means when we increase the force, the pressure also increases. And at this, according to this formula, the pressure is inversely proportional to the area. Okay, children? When the area is, the surface area is increases, the pressure will be decreases. Okay? The area of contact is uh, decreases, the pressure will be increases. So, in this way, the sharp edge uh, and is cuts our finger point. And uh, also, the cutting of vegetables are uh, in the same way. Okay, children? This is the amount of pressure. Okay, children, we are here usually see the people in our villages, they are using sumba on their heads when they are carrying very large um, things. When they uh, bring milk from, sorry, bring a bottle from uh, outside this area, the people carrying water from wells or borewells from long distances, they use sumba on their heads. But the cloth is uh, used to light this on the heads. Why? Because this, this type of is called 
Sumpa on their heads. Why is they using Sumpa on their heads? The pressure of the pots is uh, acting on the head. They do not uh, use the Sumpa the way the area of contact is decreased. The area of contact is decreased. So that's why they feel very stressed. If they are using Sumpa, the area of contact is increases. So the pressure will be decreases. So on, that's why the people using Sumpa on their head. This is a very good observation in our lives. Okay, children. Okay, children. Once again, I repeat the force. Please simply. Okay, force is the main two types of forces. Pull or push. Pull or push or called as a force. Okay, children. The force are the main two types. One is contact force and the other one is field force. And again, contact force is four types. Muscular force, when we apply the force with our muscles, this type of force is called muscular force and normal force and frictional force and tension. Okay. Next another one is field force. Field force is again three types of force. The electron static force, the magnetic force and gravitational force. So what is the difference between? These two key uh, forces and contact forces, the objective both are in uh, contact, in contact, near contact, is, uh, this is in not contact. Okay, children? And another two topics, another topic in force is uh, pressure and FPD. Uh, FPD means, you know, children, once again I remember three body. The so these are the main top, non main topics in this lesson. It is very interesting topic. So you are all write the notes and post in our groups. Okay. Okay, children. In our textbook, a little bit the question, think and discussion. Does pressure have a direction? Pressure is directional energy. Another. So, here we apply the force on the area. So, here we apply the force on this area in the in perpendicular direction. But, in the object, this force is acting throughout the area. So, pressure has a, we apply the force has a direction. But, pressure, the unit area from Pressure, the force is not, the force has a, no direction. That's why the pressure is not a vector. So, uh, in next class, you know all the about vector quantities and uh, scalar quantities. The quantities uh, who had, which had uh, magnitude and direction, the quantity, uh, the quantities are called vectors. Uh, the quantities have only magnitude, so but that the quantities are called a scalars. So pressure is a scalar. Pressure is a scalar quantity. Pressure is a scalar quantity because it has a direction, it has a magnitude, but there is a no direction. So you learn the two things, uh, two uh, things, uh, and in another class, next to ninth class. Can you learn this super simple topics briefly? Okay, children. Today we are learning about the pressure very briefly. So pressure is a nothing but a force. The force acting on perpendicular per unit area is called pressure. So we are uh, doing the activities. We are doing uh, other activities of the force. Uh, we can uh, see the children. You can uh, you see the petrol tankers and um, also now uh, truckers is uh, our vehicles have a fuse tires why they have fuse tires so think and discuss your uh, friends and family 
and also read about these topics in your YouTube channels also. Okay, Shilpa, take care and read this uh, topic once again. Your uh, we say all the very best to you. Take care, stay home and stay safe.